types of forces. Forces have many shapes or many forms. Like the contact force, it means a force that acts on an object through direct touching. Friction force, it is the rubbing of two surfaces when they contact each other. Like the uh, friction between the car tires and the road. And also like the friction between your hands when you rub each other together. Air resistance, it's another type of force. And also it's a kind of friction force. Happens the, uh, like the pushing of the air against another object, like the friction between the air and the plane, for example. Water resistance. The pushing of water against another object move uh, another object move uh, moves on the uh, uh, surface of the water like the friction uh, the, like the water resistance between the boat and the water. The gravitational force or the weight it is the force that pulls object toward the center of the earth that keeps us stuck on the surface of the earth. Gravity gives object that has uh, 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 gives any object that has mass on Earth its weight. So it is the space in Earth. So in the space, objects float in a state of weightlessness. Okay, or it doesn't have weight. In this picture. We have different types of forces like the friction force, gravity, applied force from this uh, person, a pushing force from this person on this uh, um, car, the drag force, okay, the tension force when you uh, pull the rope, the magnetic force also, and the spring, uh, the force inside the spring. Let's discuss the friction force. What is friction force? Friction is a force between two touching objects. Friction force acts in the opposite direction to the movement. When object move, uh, for example, on a car on a road or a plane in, uh, uh, in the air, okay, they faces they face a friction force. This force has opposite direction to the movement. Friction makes it harder for things to move or make things stay still. Gases and liquids can also cause friction like what we said before. Air resistance and water resistance are both kinds of friction force. What about the factors affecting on the friction force? The friction is affected by two factors, the surface material and the surface area. What's the meaning of surface material? The surface material, the rough surface have high friction force. The smooth surface the smooth surfaces have low friction force in this picture this boy pulls the uh, box easy because the surface is smooth but this but, but, but this one pulls this box with a higher force because the friction force is higher because he tried to pull the, uh, the box on a rough surface. The second factor that affects on the friction, the surface area. Large surface area lead to high friction force. If we look here on this uh, uh, object, this one has a large surface area 
so it will face a higher friction force with the ground. But this object, which has a small surface area, will face a low friction force. Also, these boats, this one has a large surface area, so it will face it, it will face a high higher friction than this boat which has a low surface area. Also the ground here is rough and also the ground here is smooth. The advantages of friction forces, okay, or the benefits of friction forces. First, friction between our shoes and the floor stop us from slipping. Friction between tires and the road stop cars from sliding. We can increase friction by using certain materials like rubber has high friction force. So we use rubber for making the tires of cars. It can stop the car from sliding off the road. Friction between the brakes and wheel help bikes and cars to slow down or to stop. Friction forces are much smaller on smooth surfaces than on rough surfaces. What about the disadvantages of the friction forces? Number one, sometimes we want things to move easily for example a bicycle in a very difficult to ride if there is too friction force between the axle we can reduce the friction force by using lubricants such as oil or grace this is called lubrication what is, what is the lubrication? Lubrication is adding oil or uh, grace to reduce the friction force. Friction produces heat and noise. For example, if you rub your hands together, you will feel the hotness because of the friction force. If a car engine runs without any oil in it, the high friction force between the moving metallic parts inside the car causes heat and stop the engine from working. Rusty door hangs squack and make a door difficult to open. So the rust causes high friction. The friction force can be reduced by having smooth surfaces and smooth shapes. Thank you.